Hello Survivors! After releasing update 8, devs added electric fences in Sons of the Forest. And this trap wasn't limited only to stick fences because there is a method you can make it on stone walls. Also, I show you a method for electrify log walls. If you didn't see that, don't miss it. In that card you can see. But in this video, we are gonna go to electrify stone walls. Actually, stone walls are little difficult. Unlike the log walls in previous video I show you, on stone walls you have to first place the stones. But before anything you have to determine border of your walls. I want just build a 3 in 3 stone wall and that is little small because this is just a tutorial video. Okay and that's it. We have a 3 in 3 stone wall. Maybe some of you just tell you by yourself we can place a stick now, but it's wrong. Because if you place the sticks right now, after that you will unavailable to place a stone walls. And because of that you have to remove sticks and you have to place a stone on all of platform you placed. I mean one stone here, one stone here, another here, here. And continue to placing one stone to each wall. And that allows to you to complete walls and also place sticks and that is awesome but you're not allowed to place the sticks just on walls because you have to place the sticks exactly here and no that is little far and exactly okay that is good and here that's cool we are on right place. I recommend you to place sticks to outward because uh, after you finishing these traps, you can touch your walls from inside without damaging by electrified yourself. And that is cool method. You have to place a stick exactly outward to stone walls. Don't forget to like this video exactly here don't place the sticks here because if you place it here uh, cannibals will not damage outside because if you place it like this the only person damage hits you and that is pretty bad you have to place the sticks exactly here You see this is not too difficult for building these traps and by my thoughts this is one of the best trap I built it ever on my channel because in previous traps it costs a lot to build but on these traps it's not too difficult. You have to place a stone here and here and because we cannot place sticks here you can now remove this stone and place it exactly beside it and you will be able to place the stick you see it this is really easy 
on this time we have to leave this stone because we are not available to remove some stones but don't worry because it does not affect on trap damage After this process, you are available to complete your walls or complete your stick fences. But I suggest you to place rocks under your sticks to don't wreck your stick fences because this is little annoying. And after this, you are available to go above your sticks. And then they don't break anymore. At first I place the stick fences and after that I complete the walls. Okay now we can place our walls. Don't forget to like this video. Okay, and that is done. We have completed our walls and our stick fences. And time to place wires to all of your stick fences to electrify all of your walls. So it's time to place our solar panel. Okay, we did it finally. And after that, And that is done. Now we connect wires to each other. Okay, you can hear it. Electrify stone walls. That is little scary. But don't worry, we will don't get damage from these fences because you build it outward. But here is it's not safe. Okay, let's test this trap. What we have here. We want to test it with some cannibals. Okay, show your talent. Come on, cannibals. Whoa, you can see that cannibals can't touch the walls. And that is nice. Also, they can't jump from that. That is that is awesome. Let's test it with fingers. Oh, don't test it with fingers. Oh, it's nice for fingers too. But they can damage it. That's nice. That is awesome. If you want more of these tricks, don't forget to subscribe my channel and also don't forget to like this video to another players and survivors learn this method. Thanks survivors and farewell.